As residents of Tainui Rest Home in New Plymouth unsuspectingly sip away at their afternoon cups of tea, some special guests are just around the corner. Boredom and loneliness are two words often used to describe a life in a rest home. But in the Taranaki, there's an unusual trio here to save the day. Cisco, Marion and Dixie are a banjo singing group consisting of a horse, a woman and a poodle. They come to places such as Tainui Rest Home in order to bring a little joy to those who are often forgotten. And although Marion does the majority of the singing, Cisco loves to share his musical talents. Tainui's diversional therapist Anne Matson believes the special trio are a great therapy for the residents. It just gives, makes them smile, makes them happy, and a lot of the ones what can remember will actually talk about it for days and days and days. Just like a nurse, Cisco does the rounds through the home's residential and hospital wards, checking on unsuspecting residents and patients. And there's one patient that will need a lot of TLC. Oh, no. Oh, thank you. Don't you like the menacingly smell? I fell down oh. 18 stairs head first oh. and I've broken both arms. Marion began entertaining at rest homes 12 years ago when she felt like her mother needed some cheering up. What actually sparked your first visit to one of the rest homes? My mother. <laughs> My mother was uh, in a rest home called Telford and uh, she said to me one day, you should be, you should come and sing for us. And I'm like, okay. And ever since. And although Cisco takes up most of the room, Dixie is not to be forgotten. A veteran of the entertainment scene, Dixie has been coming along with Marion to the rest homes for the last 12 years. After a long day of walking the wards, Cisco needs a refreshment before making the trip back home. And after such a long stint of bringing joy to places such as Tainui Rest Home, does Marion think she'll be getting her own rest any time soon? No, <laughs> I'm not allowed to. <laughs> I'll probably be in one before I give up. <laughs> Emma Jones, Country 99 TV News.